Let's head over to the Beko Kitchen and meet Dunedin-based Chef Greg Piner, who's with Mark this morning. Welcome to the cafe. It's good to be here. It is great to have you here. Mark, you've got delicious Dunedin. We have. Look at this. And look at this. Look who I found. Oh, look at that. It, it's me. It's me. <laughs> smooth. And a smooth recipe. What are we going to be making today from this book, Greg? So... Um, we're going to do like a gin cured Aura King salmon. Yeah. Um, super tasty. And like, we've got summer coming up, so it's just nice and cold. Oh, refreshing. Brilliant. So oh. it's going to be awesome. And look at the fish. Look at the salmon oh, you've got. Caught it this morning. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it is so fresh. It's going to taste even delicious. And we're going to give you a chance to win a cookbook as well a little later on. We'll get the recipe going soon, OK? So stand by. And today we are celebrating the cuisine from Dunedin with Chef Greg Piner from Vault 20. A beautiful recipe book. I was having a flick through it before. It is delicious to need it. We're going to give you a chance to win that very soon. We'll talk more about that book. But welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, so happy to be here. And Mark, this is pretty exciting. Have you ever seen great. a salmon that big before? I haven't. It's impressive. I, yeah, yeah, no, I've seen a salmon that big, yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. Great specimen. And a really summary dish, as we were talking about before, you know, we've got a gin cured uh, salmon. Nice uh, and wasabi in there, nice fresh salad. It's going to be great. Oh, yeah. And we've got two chefs in the kitchen. Two chefs in the kitchen and, and an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, so Greg, less work today. you went out and caught that especially for us this morning, so yep. thank you very much. It's an Order King salmon, isn't Order it? Order King, yeah, so it's a special beautiful. sort of salmon. Oh, very special. nice. Okay, well, let's get cooking. What are we going to do first? Right, so we've got this beautiful Order King salmon here. So beautiful marbling and stuff. Yeah, isn't it? Look at this. That's so I'm going to put that in there. Spectacular. And then in here, I've just got some brown sugar and some salt. I'm just going to give it a quick mix up. Okay. And, and you're from Vault 21, aren't you? Vault 21. Vault 21. Yes. In the Octagon. In the now, Octagon. It, if you're ever in Dunedin. Amazing place. It is an amazing place with an amazing chef. <laughs> mm. Cool. And then to that, I'm going to add some gin. Okay, nice. Because you can never have too much gin. Oh, that sounds great. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a really easy technique. So you're just curing it. So you're, in, you know, you're firming up the flesh, you're enhancing the flavour of it. Um, really simple to do, but you just need a little bit of time, you know. Yep. So it's about four days to cure. Four this. days. Yeah. Yep. So um, you know, if you want to, if you want a fast recipe, it's not the, uh, it's not the best recipe. Yeah. But if you've got time, get it in the fridge, do it, and then four days, you know, it's well worth it. So I'm just going to pack that on there like that. So you're and actually it, making a crust around the salmon. Yeah. Oh, that looks impressive. <laughs> and it's well worth the wait. Trust and you think me. you know, there's there's quite a lot of salt and sugar in there, and you think. You know, you're looking at it now and you, you, you sort of, I can see your face, you know, it's, it's a little bit excessive, but it's not, you know, you, it's, it's going to flavour the salmon, it's okay. not going to make it too salty, you know. Nice. But you really do want to, you know, be quite generous with this, pack it on, you know, it's a nice thick piece of uh, flesh there, thick piece of salmon. Now this recipe is in this book, Delicious to Need, and why have you chosen to do this particular one for us this morning, Greg? What um, do you like about it? I just, I like it because obviously we're coming into the warmer months. Right. And like, it's just really nice to have around Christmas as well. Nice mm. and fresh, nice clean flavours, and really tasty. Oh, and I can smell that gin. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Okay, what do we do next? So we're going to whack that in the fridge. Okay, cool. Do you want me to do that? Yeah, that'd be fantastic. You can, I can do and that. And we did make one four days ago. So there is one in the yeah. fridge to bring out, Mike. Oh, nice. Oh, I love this fridge too. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at that. So four days later, so we just wash the wash the marinade off, give it a dry, and and you know look at the salmon now. So it's a little bit firmer. You can see it sort of change that colour on the outside, but you're just going to get that beautiful seasoning through the whole um, flesh of the salmon. It's absolutely fantastic. Yum. So so all you need to do now is just slice it. Slice it, um, and then basically we'll make a quick salad, a vinaigrette, and then finish the plate up. It'd be beautiful. It's fantastic. So wasabi and apple vinaigrette as well. Mm. So looking forward to that. Yeah. Fantastic flavours. Wow, oh, that is some love of a salmon. That oh. is love of Dunedin as well, and loving your work. We're going to talk more about this book very soon because honestly, it has just not only got great recipes in it, about 90 recipes, but it's also got some fantastic stories about some very cool Dunedin people. We are in the Beko kitchen. We are doing a recipe from Delicious Dunedin, the recipe book, which we are going to give you the chance to win very soon. Greg features in it. Great photo from Vault 21 in Dunedin, and that's the thing about this book, isn't it? It's just full of great. Great produce and recipes from the people of Dunedin. Oh, it's an amazing book. Great recipes. Um, and it's all about locals, like promoting locals and stuff. And like, I'm proud to be a Dunedin knight. 
Yeah, and that's the thing too. I was having a flick through. It's not only you know about the recipes, but it's also about the produce and the places you can go and visit in Dunedin. It is a beautifully photographed book as well. Uh, so uh, we'll give you a chance to win that very soon. Let's get into the salmon though. So we've cured our salmon, ready to go, gin cured salmon. Mm. Yum. And now we're <laughs> doing the salad. Yep, so I'm gonna make a quick vinaigrette. So I'm just gonna grate some apple, okay. like so. And then I'm gonna squeeze the juice out of the apple. And it gives that, that really nice crisp mm. flavor. Nice work. So the, you're gonna use that fresh apple juice for the, for the base of the vinaigrette? Correct. Fantastic. And Greg, what, why a green apple? Is that the one you prefer? Is that what you like with this recipe? No, I just like green apples. You just like green apples? Yeah, okay, just, to me they're just nice and fresh, nice. crisp. They're yeah, just more refreshing, aren't they? Yeah. Nice. Okay, so you don't need to peel the apple, you just grate away just and then you get away. one of these cloths, you can squeeze it out, get all the juice. Nice and quick. Nice and quick, so just like this. And then just squeeze away. Oh, nice. And it doesn't get any fresher in that. Yeah, and I can smell that. Cool. So to that, I'm just going to add a little bit of um, palm sugar, which I've grated. Okay, nice. Just like that. And then I've got some wasabi paste. Okay. So you can use as little or as much as you want for this. Depending on your taste, yeah. <laughs> so a good dollop of that. Oh, he's one of the good... Oh, yeah, oh, you've been dollop. hanging out with big Mark, dollop. haven't you? Yeah. He likes things Sorry, hot and spicy. Mike loves it spicy around here. <laughs> he loves chilli. And, and then, then a little bit of oil. a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> just like so. And then basically... That's an apple vinaigrette, wasabi oh. vinaigrette. Look how quick and nice easy it was. But it's going to be so fresh, and the and the sugar's just going to balance off that sort of, you know, the sharpness of the wasabi, but you still get a nice little kick. Um, but it's going to be amazing with that salmon, you know, the richness of the salmon. OK, I might just have a wee, uh, wee taste there. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. It's emotional, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, really <laughs> nice balance with that apple juice and the wasabi, actually. That's good. Cool. I like it. I like it. I'm loving it. All right, so we've got some vegetables here. We've just um, finely chopped some radish, apple, red onion, fennel. And yes. um, we've got the salmon there. So Greg's going to start slicing the salmon, and we'll stop plating up. But, you know, great, great summery dish. So oh, you look just, at that. Look at Ooh. that. So just nice and thin. You don't want it too thick. And so you've left the skin on here. Yep, just as a base. Just as a base to help you slice. And yep. then you sort of slice in, angle the knife, and yep. you just cut in under the skin. Oh, so yeah. you haven't got any skin on the actual salmon when you serve it. Fantastic. <laughs> How many people are watching at home thinking, I can't wait. Actually, whip this up today, sit down, watch Grand Designs tonight, be beautiful. Oh. Well, or next, you can next just... week's episode, because it takes four days. Oh, yeah, sure, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, you can get it curing today. Go and get your salmon, get it curing now. We've shown you how to do that part. And of course, uh, that recipe book, 90 Recipes, beautifully photographed by Kelly Lindsay, features all of the produce and the local identities in Dunedin. It's a work of art, a beautiful cookbook. So full of great stories, full of great recipes. This one here, we get to eat a little later on. So thank you so much, Greg, for coming in. So I'm just going to start building that up now. A little bit of apple. So you got apple first. A bit of onion. Watch the pro. He's an award winner, Greg. Three times finalist in the Silver Fern Farms Restaurant Awards. You won an award for Best Venison Dish last year, didn't you? Yes. Yeah, see, there you go. He so knows what he's doing. Yep. Bit of crest. Oh, my God, it's coming together nicely. Just like so, spread that out. Nice. Well, I'll let you guys finish that off, and we'll show you the finished product at the end. It's time to check out our finished product here from Delicious Dunedin. Greg, thank you so much. Look at that, everybody. Wow. Ooh, beautiful. That is Delicious Dunedin on a plate. Okay, it's the Order King salmon as well. And we're going to give you the chance to win a copy of this, Delicious Dunedin, if you would like to. We've got three copies to give away. Just go to our Facebook page and enter. Thank you, Greg. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. What are you going to be doing tomorrow? Right, tomorrow I've got a vegetable curry on the menu.